the NSAS campaign, to me, you know, uh, also for us as young people, is it's not just about ending SARS. It's mm -hmm. real, yeah, it, I mean, the, the roots of the campaign is from uh, the SARS and police brutality in the society mm -hmm. and the extrajudicial killings that happens all across the country. But um, the campaign was uh, rooted, I mean, was battered on the heels of, you know, the various uh, incidences across the, across, across the nation in terms of uh, bad governance, and uh, several other agitations of the Nigerian people, especially young people. So um, it's not only about ending SARS, it's only, I mean, it's also about ending injustice, corruption, bad governance, and uh, various vices that exist in the Nigerian political system. And uh, the lucky incident happens to be an unfortunate incident that, that now further emphasizes the challenges that were being highlighted, that I mean, the challenges that actually battered the campaign itself. Because that's at a time when we're asking that, yes, we want good governance, we want, you know, police reforms, we want our police to be better paid, we want better security in the country, we want to end police brutality. And then police brutality was further brought to the fore. And, you know, um, you know a more uh, glaring view by the manner in which people were being confronted in a peaceful protest all across the country, not just Lekki uh, in Lagos. But even here in Abuja, we saw an offensive, indecent offensive against people who had come out to peacefully protest, I mean, you know, in their rightful manner, and which for us is extremely, um, uh, is extremely uh, very, very, I mean, it's, it's disgusting, I mean, I must say, but uh, as it stands now, Lekki has, happens to be in the eyes of the world because um, the, and of, uh, of course, the incident was brought to the fore, especially by, I mean, one of the young people who, who witnessed the incident in person of the Jesu, who made a live broadcast, who made a live uh, feed of what was happening. And it was gory. I mean, for a lot of us, we've had sleepless nights ever since then. A police officer would end very, very, mega amount of, I mean, if, I mean, very ridiculous salary. Because the implication is that you're asking them to go and get the balance from the people on the street. And then they become aggressive if you are not found guilty of anything that warrants that you're gonna bribe your way out. Then if you become guilty of anything, it becomes easy to bribe your way out. Therefore, security as of this time in this country is nothing to write home about. So we demand police reform. This police reform is in the interest of the citizens, it's in, in, the, in the interest of the police system. So these five uh, demands, reform the police, end oppression, end, ba end bad governance, reduce the co cost of governance, and provide security. I don't think those things are too much to ask, if you ask me.